Alex Morgan, dubbed not a superstar, moves on and has a heartwarming family moment with her husband after being eliminated from the World Cup. When the USWNT was unexpectedly ousted from the World Cup, it shocked the entire world. Although the Americans played excellent defense, the offense, which was spearheaded by season pros Alex Morgan and Megan Rapinoe, was a major letdown. It was therefore only inevitable that the pair bore the most of the responsibility following the unexpected dismissal. Even though Alex Morgan received negative feedback from numerous internet sources, it is encouraging to see him persevere. Her most recent Instagram post, which is dedicated to her spouse, stands out among the earlier criticism of her as a welcome wave of happiness. Alex Morgan posted a positive Instagram message to wish her hubby a happy birthday. Alex Morgan wished her husband Servando Carrasco a happy birthday earlier today on Instagram. The romantic post featured a selfie of the couple with a breathtaking statement. Along with wishing Servando a happy birthday, the caption disclosed that the pair also marks their anniversary on the same day. On this day 16 years ago, I made the decision to take my shot. Every day following that, I was pretty dang pleased with how it turned out. The USWNT co-captain wished her happy birthday to my one and only on Instagram. Since the USWNT's World Cup exit, Alex Morgan has been the subject of intense scrutiny. Bill Simmons, the Ringer CEO, has been particularly harsh in his criticism of her. Despite everything, it is incredibly encouraging to watch Morgan enjoying her life as she ought to. Soccer is still a game at the end of the day, regardless of the stakes. Bill Simmons attacks Morgan's ability and calls into doubt her title as a superstar. Simply put, many people found the USWNT's World Cup exit to be embarrassing. They were supposedly the favorites after all. A sudden departure like this will undoubtedly hurt and sting. Like many of us, Bill Simmons was disappointed in the USWNT's performances and in his return podcast he criticized the entire team. He was particularly critical of Alex Morgan, the co-captain.